Liara, you had something you wanted to discuss in my cabin? Yes, I'll be right up. Come on in. Thank you. Could we sit? I've been thinking about the knowledge we gathered on the Reapers, and how easily it could be lost again. So, I put a plan in motion to preserve things for the future. What's this? A record of the galaxy. Information on the Reapers, relays, different cultures, and blueprints of the Crucible. But there's one entry I wanted your opinion on. Which one? Your own. I'd be honored to have your input. How would you like history to remember you? 50,000 years is a long time for a computer to sit around. Please, I was an archaeologist. I know what I'm doing. I'm encasing these records in time capsules and seeding copies on multiple planets. And while it's not foolproof, the VI I'm installing has every translation and linguistics program I could find. So it's an information guide like Vigil on Ilos? Yes. I've been preparing it for some time. And it will be a privilege to guide the future discoverers of these records. Have you decided what you would like Dr. Tassoni to write in your entry, Commander? You know me well enough to fill in the blanks, Liara. Are you sure? Yeah. I'd like it to be your call. Well, I'll say Commander Shepard was born on Mindwar, but never let what happened there define her. Shepard was also a deadly tactical fighter. Most enemies never saw her coming. She was a soldier and a leader, one who made peace where she could. And it was a privilege to know her. Careful this doesn't sound like a diary. I can't help myself. You're a good friend, Shepard. You've been there for me too, Liara. No, I haven't. I wish I could have joined you back on Ilium. You made up for it. Well, I suppose I did just write your name in the stars. Signal confirmed.
Crash site's a nightmare. Looks like Rex was right about Reaper scouts. Edie, any further intel? The mission brief identifies the Turian commander as Lieutenant Tarquin Victus. Victus? The Primarch's son. Try to raise him. I've heard rumors of Cerberus activity on Tachanka, but nothing about Turians. Commander, I have to land well back from the main crash site. Is that the best you can do? Yes, ma'am. The Reapers seem unaware of our presence. You might get the jump on them. All right, set her down. Let's save this platoon. Okay. Did you raise Lieutenant Victus? Yes, but the connection is bad. Patch me in. This is Commander Shepard, Alliance Navy. Do you read? This is Lieutenant Tarquin Victus of the 9th Platoon. We're pinned by reefer harvesters and taking heavy casualties. Also, there are pockets of my men scattered along the crash trajectory. Lieutenant, I need you to fire a flare so I can find your position. Got it. Things get worse by the minute. My men are dying! This sounds bad. Let's move. The level of destruction is rather amazing. Any idea what these Turians were here to do? Maps of the area list no important resources. escape pod. It appears that they survived the crash, and then a harvester exploded the pod. Died in the explosion? And then pulled out to be eaten by husks. Huh. Picking up auditory evidence of... Okay. I have a visual on the enemy, and there's an escape pod just beyond. Looks like the Turians are in tough. Enemies up ahead don't know we're here. Then surprise is on our side. Exactly. Let's go. crash site ASAP. We managed to save them all. The pressure for Lieutenant Victus to succeed in light of his father's promotion must be intense. Organic species give disproportionate credit to parental influence. 
Peer groups are a more important factor in determining behavior. Shepard here, what's your status? Marindy! Commander, what's your ETA? Hang tight, we're on our way. Arnick, how's our velocity? Deceleration online, we'll survive. Victus is going to pay for this. Court Marshal are hanging. As a commander, how do you live this down? When we find him, we'll ask. Shepard here. Just saw monsters from a lot of enemies. Understood. Krogan. I need these guys working together. Better not to complicate things. Lieutenant Victus? Commander Shepard, my men and I are in your debt. Thank you for saving so many. What happened here? It screwed up. Stand down, soldier. These men are dead because of him. I said, stand down. Hey, I just saved all your asses, so everyone just calm down. Lieutenant. What's going on here? I made a bad call. This is all on me. I chose caution and clever tactics over a head-on attack. And my men paid the price. You mean the crash? Yes. We could see on Hollow that Reaper forces were blocking our intended path. Staying on course guaranteed heavy casualties. 
So I chose a safer route, skirting the enemy. And that took us low and through these ruins. When we encountered resistance, there was no room to maneuver. Suddenly, we were in a fight for our lives. A lot of my men lost that fight. Owning your mistake takes guts, but you have to get over it and move on. Of course. It's just fresh right now. Our mission's still a failure. When we've stabilized the injured, we'll head back to the fleet. You're abandoning your mission? We're down over 30 men. It'd be suicide. What exactly did you come here to do? There's a bomb on the planet. We were sent to defuse it. A bomb? How big? Enormous. Cerberus has it. Lieutenant, if Cerberus has that bomb, you have to finish your mission. Haven't these men sacrificed enough? I understand. This kind of sacrifice is the hardest to ask for, but your men signed on for it, and so did you. My men have lost hope, Commander. Even if I wanted to finish the mission, they don't. It's your job to make them want to. How? Their sacrifice means that others will never face what they faced here today. Remind them that those sacrifices have no honor if the mission fails. Men, I own what happened here today. But we have to carry on. No, we don't. Who cares about a few dead Krogan? It's over. We are Turian. And we will not let Cerberus succeed. Our sacrifice is the difference between life and death for this entire galaxy. Let the heroes of the Ninth Platoon be remembered for performing their duties with bravery. All right, men. Shuttle's arriving any minute. We're moving out. Commander, come with us. We're a shell of what we were. We could use the help. Send me the nav point. I'll see what I can do. Thank you. That'll give us time to do a little recon. See what we're up against. Victus, you have a second chance here. Make their sacrifice count. Understood, Commander. Hope to see you at the rendezvous. Cerberus bomb. What the hell is going on, Commander? And what do the Turians have to do with it? Coordinates Victus gave me place it in the Kelphic Valley. It's a heavily populated area. That's all I know. My gut says something's not right here. What do you suggest? Get the Primarch to come clean. Should we alert the Krogan military? I'd wait. We're in the dark here. Krogan-Turian relations are fragile until the genophage is cured. Let's not push it. And how about this bomb? How many troops does Cerberus have on this? No idea. All I know is, we can't have them detonating that bomb. Keep me in the loop. Hack it out. Primarch Victus. Impressive work on Tuchanka. I'm grateful that... Why didn't you tell me about the Cerberus bomb? Why hide that? What else are you keeping from me? I have nothing for you. For our alliance to work, I need to trust you. Our friendship is new, Commander. Would you trust me with information that puts your people, puts Earth, at risk? Why would I jeopardize our alliance by lying to you now? It doesn't make sense. Decisions like these weigh heavy on me. When I was a general, I could pass them up the chain of command. But now, I'm all I've got. Know what I mean? Sure. And? And... And that's all. Wait, there is one more thing, Commander. Thank you for saving my son. What was that all about with the Primarch? Turian's up to something? It's nothing. Don't worry about it. Uh-huh. All right. That's it for now, Rex. Let's get back to work. Anytime. I had a buddy who got discharged. Category 6 after Eden Prime. That six? Damn. Well, if I'd been on Eden Prime, I'd have lost it too. 
He fought it. Said he was still fit for duty. Are you all right, Commander? It sounded like things were bad down there. The Turians took some heavy losses, but we got them out okay. Well, whatever you did down there stirred up a lot of Turian comm traffic. What are they saying? Sorry, it's encrypted. Cracking it would take at least a week. And it would be wrong. We hear you, 9th Platoon. We're approaching the bomb site, Commander. Getting bounced around pretty bad. This is as close as we get, Lieutenant. Look for somewhere to set your platoon down. Copy that. Talk to me about this Cerberus bomb. It's not Cerberus, Commander. It's... Turian. What do you mean, Turian? It was planted centuries ago, after the Krogan rebellions. The bomb was a safeguard against another galactic war. Hedging your bets, huh? You won't earn trust with tactics like that. But right now we focus on disarming that bomb. Yes, but Cerberus found it. Detonation means all-out war between my people and the Krogan. Right. Where is it? Those buildings ahead. Cerberus brought equipment to dig it up. The 9th Platoon will cover your flank, Commander. With all this activity, the Krogan have to know something's up. Then we can't fail, Commander. Copy that, Lieutenant.
Turians must have feared the Krogan to plant such a weapon. Maybe the Turians have more in common with us than I thought. had to dig it out. An effective way to deal with an enemy. The Turians who created this have my respect. But we're running out of time. Commander, we're entering the box. We're both moving Bravo. towards the control. They'll be swarming out in the middle now. Agreed. Okay, but Rex. Cerberus will return to correct that mistake. Control schematics for automated turrets. No good now, but they might be useful later. Clever. The right charge about the Volta. We need to hurry. I'm at the control panel, Commander. Cerberus set up a firewall around the trigger mechanism to slow us down. I need to create a bypass. That'll take time. But like you said, no trigger, no explosion. Are you sure you can disarm the trigger? Yes, it's old tech. I know what to do. Buy me a few minutes, Commander. We'll make sure you have the time you need, Lieutenant. Understood. Starting bypass. And thank you for making sure I get this chance. Just make it right, soldier. Look out! Commander! Focus on the bomb. We'll handle Cerberus. <laughs> Nobody gets past us. Protect him! Clear. Protect him. Trigger mechanism. It's set to that. Disarm it. No time. I have to separate the trigger from the bomb. Now. Cover me.
Commander, I've got radio chatter coming in from Krogan Forces planet side. Sounds like they started sweeping out the remaining Cerberus troops. Hate to be the guy who told the Krogan about that surprise package. Did you get out all right? Sounds like it got ugly down there. The Turians took a lot of casualties, Joker. The Primarch's son included. Understood, Commander. Joker out. You can spend your whole life making up for your mistakes. At least the guy went out in a blaze of glory. We still talking about the Primarch's son? Don't worry, Lola. I'm not going anywhere. I'm getting tired of seeing people die. Lieutenant Victor's fought for a cause he believed in. A soldier can't ask for more than that. He died well. Nobody dies well. I'm tired of saying otherwise. Good work on T'Chunker, Commander. Stopping that bomb prevented the war between the Turians and the Krogan. We can't afford that kind of division right now. Joker said the Krogan are recovering the bomb? They moved in, won't allow Turians to send in recovery crews to help. Understandable. The situation is fragile at the moment. With Rex and the Primarch aboard the Normandy, you've got a situation brewing. We don't have a solid alliance between those two yet. Keep the peace, Commander. That's an order. Yes, sir. Hack it out. We couldn't risk another galactic war with the Krogan. The Genophage wasn't enough? You had to plant a bomb on my planet? The decision was made hundreds of years ago. So much has changed. Not enough to tell us about the bomb, coward. Hey. We can't let the past rip us apart. Working together, we have a chance. Primark, you had a bomb on Tachanka. And Rex, in the Turian's place, you would have done the same damn thing. Shepard! It's over. His own son died today making this right. Please, Commander. It's all right. Yes, fine. Shepard, you made your point. We have stronger enemies to face. We do. <sighs> I understand your reservations before, Commander. But I hope you now understand the secrecy. Secrets get people killed. You've learned that the hard way. Yes. The hardest lesson I'm ever to learn, Commander. My son... He died with the respect of his men. I wanted to thank you for that. His sacrifice will be recorded in the histories of the Ninth Platoon. Something any father would be proud of. Yes, sir. Again, Commander, thank you for ensuring my son died with honor. It's all a Turian father can hope for. But this is war. The time for mourning is later. Is there something you need? Despite everything, Primarch, I'm sorry for your loss. Thank you, Commander. And I know I'm not the first to lose their son to this war. Needless to say, I'm committed to stopping the Reapers. That's all. Of course, Commander. Turians pull another move like that, Shepard, and this alliance is off. Just bear with me, Rex. This is hard for all of us. I've got Reapers on my planet, a bomb that almost blew up my planet, and if those two fail, the Genophage to make sure we all go extinct anyway. I don't want to hear about who has it hard. Understood. Good. Now, is there something you need? That's it for now, Rex. Let's get back to work. Anytime.
heard what Victor's did. He was a brave man. I don't think I could... Oh, there I go again. I was going to say that I could never do that. But? But I was wrong. Being here, watching you, you've shown me what it means to serve in the Alliance. You're a good officer, Trainer. Glad you finally realize it. Thanks. But not that I'm volunteering for bomb job duty. I'd suggest sending someone who has armor first, if possible. You're cleared to dock, Normandy. Do you need ground transport? I need to get to the hospital. Yes, Commander. She's got this... glow. And the Reapers. They did to her what they do to everyone. She's covered in... She reaches out, her eyes go black, and she touches one of the farmers, and he just dies. They panic, she rips them apart, sometimes touching, sometimes opening them up with biotics. The humans are turning into liquid, and I'm there, in my towel with no gun, and husks start pouring through the door. Goddess. So I ran. the night. Nobody else could have done more. Mm. But morning came and no shuttle. Afternoon and then night and I'm hiding from husks and those Turian things. The file says the evacuation team thought your position was overrun. So after two days, I still don't have a gun because those Turian things can't use theirs. I realize that shuttle isn't coming. Not unless I get back to the farm and my radio. And the farm girl? She was with me. Even killed a few husks. With a stick. to the farm. We snuck down the hill. We were hungry, filthy. They'd turned the towel into a kind of tunic. They'd cleaned up the bodies to make more husks, I figured. But there were still farmers alive. They were being held prisoner. And Nairo was there, directing the other forces. I could see her. I, I got within ten meters of her. I just had my gun. What happened next? I got to the prisoners. The farm girl unlocked their restraints, and... Yes, and they all started screaming. Welcome, Commander Shep. One moment, please. Now One moment, please. Now arriving at Huerta Memorial Hospital. The prisoners were indoctrinated. I think. And once the alarm was sounded? Naira's eyes were black. The whole time, not just for a second. I could feel her mind from where I was standing. The humans were in the way, attacking us. I used my biotics. Flung them around. I'd been horrified when Naira tore the farmers apart, but guys, 
I ripped them in half. And it felt good. There's nothing shameful about feeling an adrenaline rush during battle. I might have killed more than Naira and those husks did. She wanted them alive, to turn them, and I... And you survived. tried to run again but we were blocked and the farm girl her leg was broken bleeding bad i knocked down a wall in a barn with a big warp field i was so proud of that and we hid they must have searched for you i'm an asari huntress no damn husk is gonna find me unless i let it but the farm girl who was with you her leg was broken she was whimpering in an ai i saw her through a hole in the she was coming closer with those dead black eyes. And Hillary, the farm girl, she couldn't stop crying. They were gonna hear. What did you do? What do you think? Welcome, Commander. One Shell. moment, please. One moment. In addition to your medical discharge, the government wants to give you a medal. The intel you provided when that shuttle finally found you, you saved a lot of lives. And I killed those farmers. They were indoctrinated. You had to defend yourself. And as for Hillary... You idiot. When I took a shower and left my gun in the bedroom, I killed them. Ira. At least she can blame the Reapers. But I'm just... Me. The color of my eyes. Did they turn back after? Or... Could I get that gun now? I'll see what I can do. the destination. One moment, please. Now arriving at Presidium Commons. Overcharging for goods. I rescued those soldiers from Reaper territory. Excellent work. The Shadow Broker has authorized me to offer you a finder's fee for his guard's safety. And now that our business is concluded, I have to tend to some other engagements. Goodbye, Kanala. Welcome to Kanala Exports. Kanala Exports is pleased to offer goods for security and peace of mind. We appreciate your visit. Welcome to Elkos Combine Arsenal Supplies. Any opened goods can only be returned for store credit. Elkos Combine. If it exists, we carry it. Don't be left out in the cold. Ask about our full service warranties. Elkos Combine. If it exists, we carry it. Don't be left out in the cold. Ask about our full service warranties. Please visit any of our Elkos Combine affiliate branches for any and all warranties needs. Welcome, Commander Shepard. Please select the destination. One moment, please. Now arriving at Docking Bay E-24. Emergency civilian housing. What will you do when they let us out of here? Go to my wife. She was visiting family in Omega. 
I hope you find her. Yeah. Thanks. So, what are you going to do? Get drunk, sign up with the Alliance, ask them for the biggest gun I can carry. Yeah. Nail a few Reapers for me. Right between the eyes, my friend. Things Cerberus did during the coup. That's not the organization I joined. So many here had to leave loved ones on their homeworlds to try to comfort them, but I know what the Reapers are capable of. So many here had to leave loved ones on their homeworlds. Have you found my son? I found your son's body in the slums on Benning. He sacrificed himself to save his squad. I... Uh, see. Their guilt made them avoid me. They should feel honored by his sacrifice. I... I know that I do. Thank you, my friend. Using Hades Gamma as a staging area, Reaper forces have rapidly expanded into the general... 